Special thanks to Artlist for sponsoring today's video. Artlist just released a few new AI features in their platform, and in this video, I'm gonna be going over them. Let's dive in. One of the newest AI features inside Artlist is their new AI image to image generator. When you navigate to the AI image and video tab to the left side, you can see that there's a new image to image tab. You can now click this upload button to upload your own image. I'm gonna upload this headshot of mine and we'll use this to generate our images. I'm gonna click open. And how this works is Artlist will use this image that you uploaded and the description that you place inside this box here. So I'm gonna type out, put me into an astronaut suit, keep the original background of the image. So this new image to image generator inside Artlist uses Google's new AI model, Nano Banana, to generate the images. And one of the great things about this is that you can keep certain elements of the image and replace other elements as well. So in this prompt, it's going to keep the background, but just put me in an astronaut suit. So next, I'm going to click generate. This will use 100 credits. And if we scroll down here, you can see that our image is generated. As you can see, we have this new image of myself. When you click on it, you have a few different options. You can download as is. You can choose to transform this image. So if you want to take this image and then maybe add another prompt or make changes to this, you can click on this button here. And just to show you, it'll reload at the top. You can clear out the original image and just keep building off of the images that you generate. This is really the power behind this tool. Now, what's really cool is that you can take these images that you generate and make them into to videos. So let's say if I wanted to turn this into a video, I can click on the animate button at the top right, and this brings me over to the image to video tab. It'll add in a suggested prompt for me. At the bottom left, there's some options that you can change. First, you have the model type. Artless also recently added the new Pro VO3 model. So you can choose this for the best quality and prompt accuracy. And what's nice is that they update VO3 to use less credit. So you can create two times more videos. But for now, I'm gonna leave it on light. You can change the duration from five to 10 seconds. You can also choose between 720 and 1080. Keep in mind, as you change these settings here, it will use more credits. So for now, I'm gonna use the light model, five seconds and 1080p and click animate. And we'll see how our generated video will look here. And once it's done, we can click on it to view our video. It does a really nice job, especially rotating in 3D space. You can choose to upscale it or download it as is, or you can go back to view the original image. Now, not only can you generate images and video using Artlist, you can also generate voiceovers as well. Let's take a look. So if we navigate to the AI voiceover tab, you can see that we have different voices we can choose from to generate a voiceover. You can sort by voice type, by gender, by voice category. And even when you scroll down, it gives some visuals of kind of what it would go well with, as well as a short description for each voice. You can click play to preview one of them. Here's to the bold souls. So I'm gonna select this one. You have some options down below. You can choose the language, the accent, how fast they speak, the emotion, and any effect that you'd like to add. You can type out a prompt in the text to voice field here. When you're done, you can click generate. And here's an example. Going to space is a brave adventure but only few will take this journey alone. Now, if we go to the effects category, there's a lot of different effects we can use. For example, they have a monster, which would probably sound pretty cool. Let's choose the monster effect and see how this sounds. Let's play it back and take a look at the video as well. Going to space is a brave adventure, but only few will take this journey alone. So you can see you can get really creative with the voiceovers and the AI image and video generators. Now, one cool feature that's inside the AI voiceover tab is that you can clone your own voice as well. So if we go back to voice catalog, you'll see that there's a new clone a voice tool. If we click on it, you can choose to upload a voice recording. Just be sure that you have permission of the voice that you're uploading. For this example, I'm gonna use a clip of my own voice just to test it out. So I'm gonna click upload file. Now I'm gonna navigate to my voice. For this, I'm just using a clip from my podcast, then I'm gonna click open. You can choose to remove the background noise. I'll just turn that on even though my voice is pretty clean as is. I'm gonna name my voice, so I'm just gonna name it John. You can add additional information for the description, add more details such as gender and language. I'm gonna choose English for the language. And be sure that you check this box here, just saying that you consent that you have the rights and permissions to use these files. Then click clone voice. This will use 500 credits here. And once it's done, you can see that we have our cloned voice. You can click select. You can see you have the same controls so you can adjust your settings and click generate. And we'll see how close this sounds to my voice. All right, here we go. Going to space is a brave adventure, but only few will take this journey alone. Wow, that sounds pretty close. I also wanted to test out the vintage radio as well. Let's see how this sound effect 
sounds as well. I'm gonna click generate. Let's see how this one sounds as well. Going to space is a brave adventure, but only few will take this journey alone. Now, one of the other really cool tools inside Artlist is their art boards, and you can use the power of AI to help curate assets for your project. So for example, with the space theme, I can curate a bunch of space assets such as music, sound effects, stock footage, all curated through an artboard. Let me show you how this works. So from the left-hand side, you'll see the artboard section. You can click plus to make an artboard. You can describe what you're looking for. So in this example, I'm just gonna type in making a video about going to space and then click get suggestions. As you can see, we have different suggested assets that we can use for our project here. We can click play to preview. When we find something we like, we can click the add button to add it to our artboard. We can also add different footage as well. We can click the explore all to see all the different assets Artlist suggests for our video. And at the top, you can see all the assets that we've added to our artboard. If you'd like to share this artboard with others, you can easily click the share button and there's a lot of different ways you can share this. This is very helpful if there's a client that you need approval from, or if you just wanna send them some of the visual and audio elements that you plan on using for the project. You can also add in the AI generated voiceover and images and video to your artboard. So if we go back to AI image and video, my creations, we can click on the ellipses next to these video and images and go to add artboard. Same with the image as well. You can add this to our artboard. And now when we go back to video going to space artboard, we can see that we have our generated assets included as well. We can also add in our AI voiceovers as well. So I'm just gonna go back to our voiceovers, click on the ellipses, go to add artboard as well. So we can add these in here. Now that we have all of our assets curated inside our artboard, we can download the ones that we want and edit them together to create a final product. Let's take a look at the final product, all created with assets from Artless. Going to space is a brave adventure, but only few will take this journey alone. That was pretty cool. Now, if you're interested in using the AI features in Artlist, you can use my link down in the video description and receive two additional months for free. Thank you, Artlist, for sponsoring today's video. Now, AI tools are just one way that you can level up your video editing. If you want to learn more ways inside Premiere Pro, there's several tutorials on my channel. I will leave one that you might like linked right up there. Feel free to go check that one out. But that does it for this video. We'll see you guys in the next one. Take care.